Hey guys, Anime Knight here. It's, and I bring some very good news. SNK's real Saudi Arabian owner aims to have the King of Fighters developer retain its Japanese identity. I want it to be, I want to once again be as bright and soaring around the world as it was in the 1990s. According to current company owner Saudi Arabian Crown Prince Mohammed bin Sal Salman, rather than attempting to change the core culture of the King of Fighters series developer SNK to appease foreign audiences, he believes that the key to, to the company's future success is keeping it true and keeping it true to its original Japanese identity. The option of His Royal Highness, who took a 100% share ownership of the developer after it was purchased in 2022 by his nonprofit MISK Foundation, or MISK Foundation, was first divulged to the public courtesy of SNK's current CEO, Kenji Matsubara. Amidst a presentation regarding SNK's current operations given during the recent 2024 Game Creator Conference, Matsubara recalled as machine translated by D. Bell a conversation he had with Sir Bin Salman regarding his plans for the company's future. According to the CEO, when pressed as to whether he would like to move SNK to Saudi Arabia and make it bigger or develop more and more games using SNK's IP in the US or in Europe, the Crown Prince reportedly asserted in turn, I want SNK to grow as a Japanese company. I want, I want it to once again be as bright and soaring around the world as it was in the 1990s. To this end, as per a recap of the panel provided by Japanese video game development news outlet Game Makers, Sir Ben Salman added that he intended to do everything he could to help the company achieve this goal. Notably, this approach to letting SNK keep on, keep on keeping on is not a new one for Sir Ben Salman. Asked by U.S. video game news outlet Video Game Chronicle following their acquisition by the by the Misk Foundation as to how much future influence the Crown Prince and his Saudi Arabian background would have on the company's operations, current The King of Fire series producer Yasuuki, Yasuuki Oda explained, For us, we're... Just focusing on making games, we're not a political company or anything like that, so it doesn't affect us in any way. That's a very true statement. I wish more companies would do this. We have Shift Up over there um, doing their thing, and we have this going on. Because um, it, it, it is exactly right. We're not a political company. We're just here making games. That's what gaming should be, and I applaud these people. SNK, is, uh, the King of Fires is actually a pretty good series, not going to lie. It's actually a lot of fun, and they have some very, very cool um, fighters of their own and an interesting <clears throat> uh, world they have. Moving on. It has no, no effect on our creative output, he detailed. We have full freedom on what we want to create. Further denying that their identity would be altered due to their new ownership, Oda added, One thing we would say is that our ownership are, are generally fans of the IP, and they have been forever, so it's up to us what we want to do as far as creating content goes. What do you guys think of all of this? Personally, this is a breath of fresh air that another company outside of Shift Up and a few other companies are doing this now say what you will about Saudi Arabia as per my video that I did a while back on the Dragon Ball um, theme park that's happening out there I have my issues with Saudi Arabia I don't have an, I don't have the issue with the Prince or its people 
It's just the certain things that go on there, but I'm going to leave it at that. However, in the current climate, of, I'm all for this. This is how gaming should be, and it's no secret. Because they want to keep creating, SNK wants to keep creating games. And not have anything political about it. The Crown Prince himself is backing this, so they have the full support. But sound off in the comments below. Let me know what you think. This is a bright step in the right direction. I'm Anime Night 1992. I'll catch you all later.